uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. <clears throat> this is October 18th, 2015. About an hour ago, I received the Logitech C930E, their business version of uh, USB webcam. Uh, I'm recording this right now. You should notice a difference because I've made a lot of videos with the 920. We should have a wider field of view here because the C930E has about a 90% field of view. Hopefully also the uh, in the past I've had a little trouble and I don't know whether it was the C920 which is a fantastic webcam. I've used it for years. It's a great USB webcam, the C920. But occasionally when I make videos, I would, uh, the audio would get a little bit out of sync sometimes with the video. And I'm not sure if that was the camera or if it was uh, some processing that I did uh, with uh, the with video software, never was really sure. But the C930E uh, does H.264 processing in the camera. And uh, that should take a load off the computer. It uh, should speed things up. I don't know, but the big news, uh, I checked and a lot of other people were doing checking to see if the C930E would work with Linux, with Ubuntu, uh, or some version of Ubuntu or Linux. And everything that I heard and saw was that it would not. Uh, like I said, this is being recorded with Windows 10. I have a dual boot computer here. It boots up into Windows 10 or boots up into Zorin 10, which is Ubuntu, but what do you want to call it? The flavor or subset or whatever. Um, just received the camera about an hour or so ago, but I booted up into, well, the first thing I did when I received the camera was, um, uh, check to make sure the driver was installed, and apparently it already was. I mean, it, when I hooked it up, it said, you know, installing, I then ran the driver that I had downloaded from Logitech and it indicated it was already there. But I uh, also had downloaded firmware upgrade. And the firmware that came with the C930E was version 8.0.825. And there was a new version out 8.0.888 so I installed that and then I uh, you know made sure the video was working in Windows which it was then I booted into Zorin 10 and I ran cheese and um, cheese immediately found the uh, camera and uh, I made a video and then I started up U or G U V C V I E W and uh, it immediately found the uh, found the camera. I had the video on the screen. I didn't go and change any settings. Wherein 
cheese, there really wasn't anything I could I couldn't change frame rates or anything at all. But when you go to the G U V C B I E W, there are settings, of course, that you can change a lot of settings that you can change in there. And I didn't change anything. And then I made a video, and you're going to see that video here in uh, just a couple seconds. And it worked. So, I am saying now that uh, the Logitech C930E does work with Linux. Now, the only thing I'm wondering about, somebody else can check on that, and I'm sure lots of people will do some checking. Remember, I already I had been running the C920 in Zorin 10, and I ran it the C920 and uh, Ubuntu uh, Studio, what is it, Pro or well, you know, in different flavors or versions of Linux or Ubuntu. So it was already there was driver already installed. So if you do decide to go and you're running Linux and you want to run this uh, and it doesn't work, uh, maybe you need to hook up a C920. I don't know, but this appears to be, not appears, this is working. The C, Logitech C930E does work in Linux, does work with Ubuntu does work with Zorin 10. And uh, here comes the video that I, I made in uh, Linux. Okay, this is cheese running on Ubuntu. And the camera is the C930E, which is not supposed to work uh, on Linux. Well, I just received it a, an hour or so ago, and I, of course, started it up on, checked it out on Windows 10. Uh, it came with firmware 8.0.875. I upgraded the firmware to 8.0.888 and it appears to be working. Well, Cheese found it and I'm trying it now with Cheese uh, in the video mode. So we'll see if the Logitech C930E does work now in Linux.